Hello everyone, Jim here from Storm Warning News. And China may declare a no-fly zone over Taiwan ahead of Nancy Pelosi's visit. Let's have a look at some details. Now, reports say Biden administration officials are concerned that China could seek to declare a no-fly zone over Taiwan ahead of a possible visit by House Speaker Nancy Pelosi as an effort to upend the trip, potentially raising tensions even further in the region. Now, China could also respond by flying fighter jets further into Taiwan's self-declared air defense zone, which could trigger a response from Taiwan and the U.S. Uh, officials added or a official added. They did not detail what a possible response would entail. And I would be very curious, as would you, to see what that would be. Now, the State Department has called on Chinese, the Chinese government to cease its intimidation of Taiwan. And Pelosi has been planning a trip to Taiwan in the coming weeks, according to three sources familiar with the planning process. And uh, while other members of Congress and former U.S. officials have visited Taiwan this year, Pelosi would be the highest ranking U.S. lawmaker to visit Taiwan in 25 years. Uh, the last high ranking official being Speaker Newt Gingrich traveling there in uh, 1997. So would it be the case that uh, should she uh, take this trip after all, that China would put up a no-fly zone around Taiwan? Is it possible? Is it possible that something even worse could happen? That uh, China maybe could uh, decide to make a move on Taiwan just before uh, Pelosi would be arriving there? All things to consider, all things we don't know right now, but we know this, that the world is a very tense, tense, treacherous, and tumultuous place right now as we are moving step by step into the end times and step by step closer to the rise of the son of perdition, the man of sin, and the start of the tribulation. Anything goes. Be expecting anything. Be surprised by nothing. But remember, the word of God is written in 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 7, which says, For God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. Press into Jesus now more than ever before, my friends. Jim signing off. God bless you, and I'll see you soon.